Educated sports talk. Stay smart, stay uneducated. Welcome, all sports fans, everyone across the nation. This is Uneducated Sports Talk. I'm your host, Carlos Clayton. This is my beautiful co host, PJ, and we are live for live commentary and play by play reaction to game one of the Western Conference first round matchup between the number eight New Orleans Pelicans taking on the number one seed, Oklahoma City Thunder, you guys. Welcome to Uneducated Sports Talk. Hit that like button if you guys are new to the channel. Smash that subscribe button. Come show some love to USC Nation. We are live, baby. Let's get, get, get it. Got some folks in the chat already. From all streams, all platforms. That's right, y'all. We are on our multi stream right now. We got folks. I see y'all from Facebook. What's up, you guys? I see y'all from Twitter. What's good? And of course, the OGs around here, YouTube, doing it big time. Thank you all for the love and the support. If you're on Facebook, I have the link pinned up right now. Click on that link. You can come to our channel, Uneducated Sports Talk. Hit that subscribe button and show some love to our channel. Thank y'all for the love. PJ, what's good with you? I know we got a good one. The Pelicans, they are without Zion Williamson. It's unfortunate for them, but still a really good squad. They'll take on the number one seed, OK City Thunder. Our first glimpse at Shea Gilgis Alexander, his first playoff opportunity as the star. Right, not as not with the Clippers as a role player, but as a star, we get that opportunity to see him now in this young Thunder squad. I'm so excited. There's a top five I had for must-see players. He was number one. He was number one in my opinion. I, I got to see him. So, shout out to everyone in the chat now for showing love. You guys are freaking awesome, man. 
Uh, we got Daniel Barry Sports Highlight says, yo, what's up, Daniel? Good to see you, my guy. Let's go. Let's go. Daniel Barry Sports Highlight showing love. I've got Thomas Green says, how about them bucks? I like what I'm seeing. Even mine is Giannis. Let's go. What's up, Thomas? Peter said, what, uh, Peter said, what's up, TG? Uh, so what's up, DBSH as well? Thank y'all for showing love. Also, we got RC Crazy About Women's Hoops. Says, I'll be over right at the NHL hockey game in about 10 minutes or so. Salute, salute. Yes, sir. It's all love, brother. It is all love. And we have, uh, he says, RC says, uh, Thomas, my patients weren't quite ready yet, man. Daniel says, go Pels. Samuel Wilkinson Jr. says, be ready, are you? NBA playoff game tonight. That's right. Peter said, what is good? That's dumb. That's dumb. I got Sam Escobar. Are in the building. We got Jennifer Baganu and Iranio Oloka. Let's go, y'all. Thank y'all for showing love. You guys are awesome. They're showing love on Facebook right now. Keep the, keep that coming. Twitter, what's good? We got folks on Twitter right now. I don't have anybody's names on Twitter. It doesn't show up, but thank you all for uh, showing love on the Twitter right now. You guys are awesome. We got a nice little crowd from Twitter as well. We got Samuel Wilkinson showing love. He says, hi, Carlos and PJ. Good evening. Good evening to y'all. This is a late one, but it's also a good one. So we're excited about that. Chris Dickerson is in the building. What's up, Chris? That's my guy, man. Showing love. I appreciate that. Laney is in the building. Says, hey, Carlos and PJ. How did the football games pan out today? Didn't get to check out any. There's only one today, and it was um, uh, the Renegade loss to the Roughnecks. I think the score was like 19-9 to or... 17-9, I think. Hoodie Jube is in the building. That's my guy. He says, UST, UST, UST. He said, what's up, Hoodie? That's right. That's our guy. Man. Hoodie Jube in the building. Zach the Potato said, the game's over. Every home team has won. So far, man. And now we just need the Thunder, right? The Thunder to continue that trend. Yo, Chris, I'm good, man. What's happening with you, brother? What's happening with you, man? Tuck the Puppy is in the building. Peter said, that's my man's. What's up, Tuck the Puppy? So Chaos has been released in the Avalanche Jets. It's 7-5 Winnipeg. Oh, my goodness. Talk about no defense at all. Talk about no defense. Good God. 12 in, in a playoff matchup? That's unheard of. Chris Dickinson said, what up, CeeLo? I'm good, man. I'm good. How about you? I'm chilling with my, uh, my Saints. Uh, my Florida Lees cup right here. Let's get it. Uh huh. Something a little different. Mm. This is cool. Thank you. Hope you have been having a great weekend so far. So good. It's been a really good weekend. I can't complain. It's been a really good weekend. B-Dog Boy says, hello, everyone. I hope all is well. It's time for a good game. Yes, sir, it is. It is. Can the Thunder keep the home winning streak going on? Every home team in this playoffs has won so far. So far, can the Thunder uh, submit that for all of game one? And that's why it's very important to have home court advantage. All these guys, all these teams drive me crazy. You know, they, they have all this uh, low management and guys taking up. Man, these games really count, bro. Like, number one through eight in the West were, like, separated by, like, what, seven games, baby? Like, it's crazy, man. You just never know. That's why home court is so, so important in the NBA playoffs. And I can't stress that enough. Andrew said, what's up, Carlos and PJ? She said, what's up, Andrew? And said, what's up, CD? That's Chris Dickerson. So I'm doing good. I'm in H-Town. Uh-oh. You on business? Or you on, uh, uh, or you on some uh, chilling time? What's out there in H-Town right now? And I'm going to look at the schedule tomorrow, see which NBA game I'm, I'm going to call. Don't know quite yet what game. Uh, is it the Knicks and the Sixers? I think I'm, I might call Knicks and Sixers. I think I'm calling Knicks and Sixers, y'all. I think so. It says, family, I got you, brother. Yes, sir. It's all love, Chris. Always good to see you, man. Shout out to everyone that's on Facebook right now. 
Shout out to everyone that's on Twitter. Everyone that's on YouTube. All right, Shay Gildas Alexander. He is the NBA MVP finalist, as he should be. If I had my own pick, I would pick him to be NBA finals. Man, there's something like, why is my neck feeling like this? I don't know why right here. I feel like something's biting me, but it's not. Maybe I'm tripping. Got Brandon Ingram and the Pelicans. Trying to be upset minded. They're doing this without Zion Williamson. They have McCollum, Ingram, Trey Murphy, Herbert Jones, and Jonas Valachunas as your starting five for the Pelicans. The one thing, if you are, hold on, here's the starting five for the Thunder now. Shea, Gilgis Alexander, Josh Giddy, Lou Dort, Jalen Williams, and we have Chet Olmgren. They, they lack size. And that's why it was so important for the Thunder. The Lakers did not win. Uh, the Lakers won that first game to be the seventh seed. Because the Lakers had the mismatch all over the Thunder. The Pelicans don't. They have JV, and that's about it, right? The physicality won't be as bad. Now, JV is still most physical player on this court right now. That's guaranteed. But not as bad as dealing with freaking uh, – the, the Lakers and Anthony Davis. That's 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 tough right there. That's tough. Here we go, y'all. We got the jump ball between Holmgren and Valachunas. It's going to be Pelicans basketball. Let's get, get, get it. McCollum. And we have uh, the fans will not sit down until the Thunder score their first basket. That's a kind of a cool thing they've been doing forever now in OK City. JV has now, and it'll go down low to Ingram. On the left part of the court, he'll face up against Dort. And he'll have a jumper about 19 feet. Missed it badly. Rebound by SGA. Oh, by the way, the Thunder played great defense as well. Giddy. Bad pass. Stolen by Herb Jones. Herb, one man to beat. Euro step layup. That's blocked by Holmgren. Get it out of here. It's a block party. The Pelicans are all invited. Josh, Giddy now on the left wing. Slow it down. He'll pass it out to SGA. All right. He's going to go ahead and post up on the left block. Double team comes in hard. He'll find Holmgren open for three. God! And that's how the Thunder start off their playoff run with a three by Chet Holmgren. All right. Herb Jones passes JV down low. Valentunez can't handle it, but he'll get it right back. Double teamed. It's going to post up on the left block on Holmgren. Fade away. Got it. That's nasty. All right, and we got Williams alley to Holmgren. He missed the dunk. It's going to be Pelicans basketball. B.I. trying to find a cutter. He'll find Herb Jones on the right wing. Back to B.I. again. B.I. down low to J.V. J.V.'s got the, the advantage over Holmgren for sure. And we got a push-off on J.V. Really? He's got a push-off. So it'll be an offensive foul call. Thank y'all for showing love. We got 18 likes already, man. Let's rock and roll. Layup. Williams, good. Five to two, your score. McCollum, drive the lane. McCollum, layup. Good. He has got to get going for this team. That's just proven facts. He has got to be the one to get going for this team. Williams will swing it out to Giddy. Giddy drives his right. Giddy is going to try and find a cutter. He'll pass out to Holmgren, top of the key. He'll swing it out to SGA on the left wing. SGA driving in, step back, jumper off the backboard. Got it! The bank is open on a Sunday night. Seven to four, your score. B.I., free throw line, pass out to Herb Jones, open for the tie. Got it! The three is good. Three by the Thunder, no good. Murphy, rebound. Trey Murphy's got to be that guy, in my opinion. Sizing up Giddy. We'll drop to his left. Big body move. The floater, no good. Rebound, OK City. Here comes SGA. 
Alexander going in the lane. Good pass out to Williams. Better pass to Holmgren. Open for three. Oh, in and out, boy. Kelly Garner says, let's go Pelicans. Hi, Carlos and PJ. Pitty said, what's up, KG? Ingram, the jumper is no good because they, they waved it off. Is that a foul before the shot? Let's go. And Tuck says, at least I got some McDonald's to ease my pants and my Renegades lose to earlier today. Man, Jesus. Sarah says, soon, next month is May. That's right, y'all. We got about, uh, what, 10 more days, and then we'll be the month of May. That rhyme, by the way. Uh, Apollo, number one, said, what's up, long time no see? Apollo, what's good with you, man? B.I. on the left block. He'll fade away. No good. Rebound by Giddy. Giddy's going to push it. We have a tied ball game at seven. Get it to Holmgren. Holmgren driving to his right. Holmgren layup. No good. Rebound by JV. He'll give it to Ingram. Ingram pass McCollum. Top of the key three for the lead. No good. Rebound by Giddy. Giddy is a triple double monster. Giddy on the right wing will slow it down. Get the screen. He'll drive to his left. Giddy floater. That's a shot. It's up and it's no good. That's usually a shot. McCollum driving the lane, floater up, and it's no good. Rebound by Holmgren. Got a lot going on so far. Jets win 7-6. Man, was crazy, huh? SGA, left wing, pass it at Holmgren. Get to Giddy. Get it to Williams. Williams, corner three, no good. Rebound by Murphy. Jerry G says, UST, Carlos, and PJ. Go Pels. What's up, Jerry G? Good to see my guy Herb Jones for the lead layup. No good, but ducked in by Valanchunas. So the Pelicans with a 9-7 to seven lead. Dana G says, go Pels. Three by Holmgren. He missed another one. And right now, they're going to live with Holmgren shooting those threes. I know I would. Dana's in the building, Sean. What's up, Dana? Jerry G's in the building and Dana G. Let's get it. And we've got Murphy driving the lane on the left block. Nowhere to go. He'll pass it back out. Ingram has it on the left wing. Gets a screen from McCollum. Ingram driving to his right. Ingram will be fouled by Williams. Oh, I don't like that call by the referee. That's too patty cake for me. Ready, PJ? So, yeah, let's get it. Let's go. We got Jerry, 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 Jerry. Jerry Paul Jr. is in the building showing love. Let's go, man. Shout out to everyone in the chat right now. Dana G and Jerry G. Jacqueline is in the building. Says, Hello. How are you doing? All good here. Hit the like button. Yes, ma'am. Thank you for the love, Jacqueline. How's life treating you? Guys are awesome, man. Smash that like button. We have our first timeout of the day. 9-7 to score. Pelicans on top. For these away teams, the lower seeds, right? They've got to keep these games close. The closer the game, the closer the game, the more the better team sort of tightens up. The Pelicans has got to keep themselves in the realm, right? Keep themselves afloat. RC says, Lowe's, what's Zion smiling about over there if he ain't going to play shaking my head? <laughs> hey, man, Zion had a hamstring issue, man. Leave him alone, man. Joyce B says, hello, everyone. What's up, Joyce? Choice in the building. You got to smash that like button for your boy. Our goal is 35 plus likes. And you guys are getting us there to our goal, man. Our goal is 35 plus likes. So thank y'all for smashing that like button. You guys are freaking awesome. We did reach our like goal of 35 plus likes for our last stream too. So shout out to you guys for showing love. We appreciate that. Give a big shout out to those on Twitter right now. Uh, it doesn't show me anyone's name on Twitter. So... You know, I apologize uh, if I don't say anyone's name on Twitter because it doesn't show me names. I have to find a way to do that. But if you are in our Facebook, you guys, we have the pinned message. It's my link to the channel so you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Come join UST Nation, man. We want to thank y'all from the bottom of our hearts, man.
Oh, I said a few knives. I ain't got a hamstring. So he got a string on ham issue. Oh, man, don't do my guy like that. Not a string on ham issue. <laughs> the beautiful butterfly says hello. Hello, hello, hello there. He said, what's up, RC? And what's up, BF? Her bestie in the building. What's up, butterfly? How you doing? Tuck the puppy says, by the keeping the pelicans afloat, you meant keeping the pelicans are flying. Yeah. There you go. There you go. You're right about that. Here we go. Dallas, my girl says, hello, my love. Carla Delgado. What's up, Dallas? Trey Murphy. Has it now. Pass out to McCollum. Top of the key. Drop to his left. McCollum step back. The runner. God by C.J. McCollum. Giving the Pels a four-point lead. 11-7. Your score. Holmgren to Williams. Williams to Alexander. The elbow. Good pass to Holmgren. He cannot handle it, though. Out of bounds. Tuck the is 21st light by me. Hey, I appreciate that. Let's get this, man. Those light buttons for you, boy. Thank you, Butterfly, for showing love. Our, our moderators in the building. And McCollum, pass out to Open Jones, three, short. Rebound goes to OK City. Holmgren, behind the back, Holmgren, might be number two in the MVP race as Giddy step back. Nowhere to go. Giddy will give it out to Williams, top of the key. Williams, crossover, pass out to SGA on the left wing. SGA, top of the key. Driving, step back, jumper, got it. Eleven to nine, your score. All right, Ingram on the left wing will get out to Murphy. Murphy's got a quick trigger. He'll drive the lane. Murphy find Herb Jones wide open, three in and out, and the, the Thunder will be happy to let him shoot those open threes all day too. Holmgren is going to post him on the left block. Spin to his left. Layup is no good. Good defense by Valanchunez. Pelicans basketball. McCollum driving to his left. McCollum in the lane. And he will knock it out of bounds on himself. Turnover. Eleven to nine, your score with five oh six remaining in this first quarter. Dallas Marcus is Winnipeg Jets beat the Avalanche. Rhino is crying in his beer. Oh, not Rhino! Not he crying. That's the squad, the Avalanche. Seven to six. I was told, man, it was a crazy game. Five to go in this first quarter. SGA being guarded by Eric Jones, one of the best defenders in the game. Behind the back pass of Holmgren for a left wing three. In and out. Rebound by Larry Nash Jr. Who's in the game for the first time. Larry Nance hand out to Ingram. Ingram on the right block. Ingram being guarded by SGA. Going to slow it down. Ingram. Pass out to Murphy for three. Too strong. And we've got a rebound by the Thunder. Rising Rhino says Rising Rhino into his house. What's up, Rising Rhino? Dortz. Pass out to Williams. Williams drives to the left. Lost the handle. Got it right back, but it's out of bounds on no one. Saved by Alvarado. Jose, 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 Jose. Murphy will drive to the left on the left side. Step back three. Air ball. He missed everything on that one. Right, says you're going hard today, UST. Yes, sir, man. Alexander, baseline, layup too easy. We have a tie ball game. Tied at 11. Yes, sir, man. We're trying, rising around. I'm trying to be like you, bro. I'm trying to be like you, man. Herb Jones, top of the key. Hand off to Ingram. Ingram driving to his right. He got a foul called on SGA. That's that's one of those, man. You, you don't want to get in any kind of weird foul trouble if you're uh, Alexander. I got Fuda Selga is watching from Facebook. Welcome, Fuda Selga. Chris's Cowboy has entered the room. Yes, sir. Mr. Chris Cowboy Dickinson is in the building from YouTube. What's up, Chris? Good to see you, my guy. Appreciate it, bro. 
Ingram pass out Ronald right three. No good, but rebound by the Pelicans. And we got a shot, and he's foul. Herb Jones going to the free throw line for two of them bad boys. We are tied at 11. Welcome, Chris Dickinson. It's my guy, y'all. One of the best co-workers I've ever had in my life, man. Dude is just an uh, all-around great person. All right, Herb Jones made the first one. He'll make both free throws. Pelicans on top by two. 13 to 11 with 3.30 to go in this first quarter. Here come his Isaiah Joe in the game now for the Thunder. And Gordon Hayward also in the game. Isaiah Joe, pump fake, pass out to Williams. And we had a foul called on Trey Murphy. I don't like. Now, nah, that's a, that's a ticky-tack call. I don't like that. I don't like those ticky tack calls. They get on my nerves. That gets on my nerves big time. Rise, I ate during intermission. <laughs> I don't blame you, bro. SGA at the elbow at the left side. He'll bring it back out to the left wing. Being guarded by Ingram. He'll drop to his right. SGA drops to his left now. Good move, stutter step, and he misses shot, but it's a foul called on Brennan Ingram. Oh, oh. I mean, ticky tack calling right now. I don't know about that one. But Ingram did not complain about it, so it must be true. It must be true, because he didn't trip on that. Uh, Irineo Olako is watching. What's up, Irineo Olako? All right, SGA will make the first free throw. Wasn't even no foul at all, man. Yeah, I don't like that at all, bro. Just two ticky tack for me. Both free throws are made, tied at 13. No, I think he missed the second one. I'm sorry. All right. Larry Nance hand off to B.I. Ingram at the right side, being met up by Williams, number 34. Kimmick Williams. Ingram, free throw line jumper is up, and it's too strong. Rebound by Gordon Hayward. Hayward passed out to Lou Dortz. Dortz, top of the key three. Got it! And the crowd going crazy now. 15 to 13 your score. Ate a whole rotisserie chicken and a fried lemon on the intermission. <laughs> you was on it, huh, RC? You was big hungry. <laughs> we got Larry Nance now on the right wing. What is your big butt doing out there? He'll pass out to Ingham on the right block. Ingram post up on Williams. Up and under. And a fadeaway. Got it. Tough shot. Goes in, though, for B.I. Tied at 15. SGA. Fadeaway jumper. No good. Rebound by Larry Nance. And here comes Alvarado on the right wing. Being guarded by Joe. Oh, the crossover. Made him fall down. The floater. Got him. <laughs> Crossover, <laughs> and he made the floater. Makes it that much better. SGA will drive in, step back. SGA, big body move, missed the layup. Rebound by Bi. The Pelicans are on it right now, up by two. Ingram pass out to Alvarado, swing out to Jones on the right wing. Jones three, no good. Rebound by Gordon Hayward. Hayward's got it. He's gonna push it. Hayward gonna find Dorts. Dorts will find Kimrick Williams. Open three. No good. And rebound goes to the Pelicans. Slow it down, right? Pass it out to Murphy. Murphy down low. Good defense, but Larry Ness will get it right back. And a great effort by Hayward with a steal. So we got three on three. SGA, draw the lane. SGA, big body layup is up and it's good. We're tied at 17. We got MKI Sports. And what up, Carlos and PJ? What's up, MKI Sports? Good to see you, my guy. All right, back and forth and forth and back we go, man. 
And RC says, salute SGA and BI. At least they care about the mid-range game. Yes, that's facts. My brother from the same mother, Darius D. Clayton's in the building showing love. What's up, D? Come on to the YouTube side as well, man. Hit that like button for your boy if you haven't already, man. What's up, you guys? Thank you for showing love, man. Tied at 17, you guys. We got a timeout. Back and forth, these two teams go. But you're right about the mid-range game. It is sort of, sort of a dead art now. See, the reason why the three wasn't shot as much from the 70s, 80s, and 90s, and early 2000s is because the percentages are a lot more difficult, right? But now, the uh, it's about Alex as well. Alex says, hey, yeah, hey, the three is just a good a shot as a, you know, 15-footer. Now, you shoot a 20-foot two, that's kind of weird. Don't do that, right? You can't shoot a 21, 20, 19-foot two. But, but the, the, from 13 to 15-foot range, right, that's the money. Those are easy shots if you can put that in your arsenal. And let's not forget about DeMar DeRozan as well, RC. Today's the games were quite surprising, but not in a good way for some. I'll tell you what. Shout out to the Bucks, man. Without Giannis, they still mollywopped the Pacers. They mollywopped them. I was very surprised about that. I ain't gonna lie. And that's like, don't put too much stock into the regular season because the Pacers just beat the crap out the Bucks uh, four to five times they met. So I get that. Don't put too much stock in that. But man, shout out to, hey, shout out to all them fools in the Milwaukee, man. Mollywopping guys. I respect it. I respect it, bro. So OKC okay, might as well start trading the 28 first round picks they have for the next 10 years. Look, they, they, hey, they're going to one of these years. They're going to match that for a superstar type player. They got way too many first round picks over the next year, right? About 10 years. They got too much stuff, man. Too much stuff. Chase. Lowe, did you know Caden Clark shot 887 times this season? Can you guess how many threes she shot without looking? Uh, without look, what do you mean without looking? You gotta look to see where you're shooting at. I'm gonna say zero times because you gotta look when you're shooting. <laughs> you know, unless it's a trick kind of question. And Michael says, but come to think, if Giannis returns, well, now I'm like, if Giannis comes back and they're just as good as that game one beatdown. Yeah, I might have to renege on my Celtics pick because my original pick was the Bucks and the uh, Nuggets. But now it could be, I mean, uh, but then I was saying now I'm saying Boston and Denver. But if the Bucks can play like they played in this game one, man. Also, the Clippers without Kawhi were all right, but can they last? Right, right. We'll find out, though. We'll find out. All right. Tied at 17. Here we go. And it'd be Pelicans basketball with 43 seconds. And we've got Najee Marshall in the game as Alvarado will drive to his right. Alvarado shot is up. And it is no good. Rebound by the Thunder. SJ has it. And there's an eight-second difference. Game clock, shot clock. And he will pass an open three-point shooter. And Williams missed it short big time. So, Pelicans will settle for the last shot of the first quarter. Double team is McCollum. He'll give it out there to Herb Jones, Alvarado. Alvarado with seven, six, five. Alvarado driving. He's going to drop to his left. And left. No, not even a shot off. Good defense by OK City. And look at his score. Look at his score. Tied at 17 at the end of the first quarter. And I told folks, I think there's been eight games played, right? It's the eighth game. I believe six of the games, right? Six of these eight games, there's been at least one team that was under 100 points, y'all. Dan McKeezy, let's go. Say hi to real fans. Sports, hey! Y'all, hit that link for your boy. 
Let's show some love to real fans, sports, my guys, man. Do me a huge solid, y'all. I'm going to come meet y'all over there. See that link sent in by the big homie Dan McKinn? Click on that link for your boy. Let's say what's up to real fan sports, man. That was my guy, Zach in nonfiction. Do me a solid. Click on that link from Dan McKinn. If you're on YouTube right now, click on that link. Let's say what's up to my guys. All right, do me a favor, y'all. Let's get it, man. Get on that link from Dame McKinn. Click on that link and let's show some love. Let's show some love. Let's see the time right now. Anne-Marie Elizabeth Rose Velowski says, good evening, everyone. What's up, Anne? Yo, Anne, hit that uh, link sent by Dan McKinn. Let's show some love to real fans. Boys, how you doing, by the way? All the way from uh, Connecticut, right? I know you are excited about that UConn back-to-back -back national championships. So, hope New Orleans Pelicans is going very well. Uh, so far, tied at 17 at the end of the first quarter. So, we're going to quarter number two. Quarter number two, y'all. Tied at 17. The Dixaway says, Light 27 smash. I appreciate it, man. Check out Larry and his amazing stream out there, y'all. The Dixaway, man. I know a bittersweet inning for your Atlanta Hawks, man. But, hey, you got the Braves. You popping it right now, man. Of course, football season with those Falcons right around the corner, bro. All right, here we go, and we got a jumper uh, that's made by uh, the Thunder, by the way, but there is a stoppage in play. It's a very low-scoring affair. I, I said it earlier, every game it feels like there's been at least one team that's been below 100 points in every game so far. I don't know what happened with the, uh, why they called timeout so quick. What happened? Did I miss something? Philly, Philly says, Carlos, sub guy with the fresh cut. I didn't know, but brother, yes, sir. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Yeah, I finally, so I had to shave all the way. And I told folks, my, so I had to get, like, butt naked with the face because I had to take my hazmat training class, all that, yada, yada, yada. But I always told folks, like, my hair grows back so fast. So this, this is literally a week after I shaved it off. I had enough for a goatee. Cool. Let's go. So I got the goatee, you know. We got the goatee in there, baby. We had 29 likes, by the way. Thank you, Philly Philly. And Dark Striker 628 says, hey, what is good? What's up, Dark Striker? Peter said, what's up, DS? And what's up, Double P? And the dicks away in the building. 887 for go attempts and 536 were three point attempts low. She definitely gonna have to bring that number down. Hell no, she don't have to, she don't want to. 
and we're at 30 likes, y'all. We need five brave souls to smash that like button. Welcome to Uneducated Sports Talk. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. All my folks from Twitter and from uh, Facebook, thank you all for showing love. I appreciate that, man. If you're in Facebook, I had the link pinned. The link is pinned. Click on that link and come join Uneducated Sports Talk. Hit that subscribe button. Let's rock and roll. I got the beautiful Courtney Thomas. Says, I missed some of the money all game yesterday, and today went under the total, and all home teams won. I'm not going to even uh, brag about it too much, but a brother did win. I won. Uh, that Bucks and Patriots game, I did the same game parlay, and I won $75 off of that. And then I had the uh, Bucks. I had I had a Bucks minus two and a half to win this game. Uh, and I won $147 off of that. So, very happy about that. I had the Bucks minus two and a half, man. I, I say, you know what? I, as much as I love the Pacers, I, I was like, it just feels like it's playoff time, man. So, I went, the game had just started. And the Bucks were up like by like uh, by like two or three or whatever. whatever like the first three minutes of the game, I was like, you know what? It was a live pitch. So minus two and a half, and I win this game. Let's go. Forget all that. Let's go. I just I could feel I just felt the way the game started. It was a live bet. It wasn't before because at first I wasn't. I had a I had a same game parlay bet, Pacers and uh, Bucks, and uh, pretty easy. I won like seventy three dollars, I believe what it was. But then I said, you know what? Bucks gonna win this game. I got a feeling. I got a feeling. So at first I wasn't gonna bet at all. I was like, eh, eh, <laughs> eh. I right, says Lowe's her new coach Indiana told her she can shoot the local three as long as they're going in. Otherwise, she's going to have to take the most efficient shot available. Well, yeah, well now you're in professional, you know, professional basketball now. You just can't be chunking it up all the time. But hell, her local threes are better than most people's threes, anyways. Murphy, good pass out to Marshall in the corner to McCollum on the right wing. Step back. Jumper. Got it by CJ. We're tied at 19. Quite as a can't complain. Either MB been doing me good. Oh, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. All right. Number 22 3 is up and it's no good. Dark says if you don't count today's game, the Casey Royals been pretty solid. Casey to the championship. Trust. Uh oh. Hey, I can kind of like, you know, I can kind of get with you on that one. The three by Murphy. Got it. Pelicans on top now by three. Could a Pelican be the first road team to win? Holmgren. Fade away. It's good. That's what Chet Holmgren can do for this team. 22 to 21 your score. All right. Alvarado. Pass it out to JV on the left block. He's going to post up on Holmgren. He will post up, pass out to McCollum, top of the key. He'll pass Alvarado. Deep three, no good, but rebound by Valachunez. Back to Murphy. Murphy, driving in. Murphy, layup, no good. But Murphy, he wants to go for that, the soul snatcher. MK, I said, I saw a post on Instagram. Dame scored 35 in the first half, but scored it in the second half. It felt like something's going to happen the next game. That's crazy, man. He scored zero in the uh, second half? Wow. McCollum, three. No good. Rebound by Wiggins. Wiggins pass to Giddy. Giddy on the left wing being guarded by Murphy. Oh, cross-court pass, but oh, Case and Wallace wasn't ready for it off his fingertips. He just wasn't ready for it. Butterflies of the party has started. Let's get it started. and hot. We're at 32 likes, by the way, y'all. We need three brave souls to smash that like button and get us to our goal of 35 likes, y'all. Thank y'all for showing love. I appreciate that. All my folks on Facebook, all my folks on Twitter, and, of course, the OGs on YouTube, welcome. Baseball been doing good. Uh, it did me good a couple days ago, like three days ago. Uh, I didn't win a lot. I think I won, like, $110, like $10, but it was on a three-game no, yeah, I, I, I bet 100 to win 110. Three is up, and it's good by Murphy. And Murphy, do not get him started, man. Kid can be a flamethrower for sure. Giddy, pass to Holmgren. 
Holmgren, handoff to Williams. Jay Williams driving to his right. Step back. Jumper. No good. Rebound by Valanciunas. And right now, I'm making the uh, Thunder go one shot and out. Arado down low to JV. Give and go. That Arado pass on the Nazi to McCollum. Right wing three. Got it by CJ McCollum. Butterfly says, yeah, close game. All right, Giddy. Driving to his right. Giddy going to post up. Almost snatched away. Good pass to Williams down low. Lamp is up and it is good. That's, oh, that's Casey Wallace. Excuse me. 28, 23 your score. JV has it now. Passes out to McCollum. Top of the key. Trey feeling splashy, says RC. Speaking of Murphy, he has it. Drives his left. Nowhere to go. Passes it out to McCollum. McCollum gets the screen. D3. No good. Rebound by Holmgren. The Thunder have it now. They're going to push it. Chet's going to push it. Coast to coast. He'll find Wiggins. Wiggins. Drive the lane. Wiggins. Back to Holmgren. Layup. Good. Back to back. Uh, layers by the Thunder. 28-25. And they'll pass out to Alvarado. No good for three. Rebound by Williams. Williams is going to push it. The Thunder are really good at doing this. The Thunder are really good at doing this. Williams really good at pushing the pace. And one. And one. Now, let's see if my and one works. I have super confidence in this. Does it work? Yeah, it don't work. All right, I apologize. <laughs> it don't work. It don't work. It's still choppy. I apologize, you guys. And he will make the end one. We're tied at 28. Just like that, a 7 nothing run by the Thunder. 7.53 to go in this second quarter. McCollum has it now. McCollum drives to his left. Pass out to Marshall for three. Got it by Najee Marshall. Pelicans back on top by three. Williams. Driving the lane. Williams passing out to other Williams. Wiggins, three. Got it! It's a rain in threes. Hallelujah, it's a rain in threes. We're tied at 31, you guys. Tied at 31. McCollum has now screen from Valentunez. McCollum driving to his left. McCollum, floater, tough. It's going to be up. But ducked in by Najee Marso. I got your back, bro. That's what he said. Dunked in by Marshall. Pelicans back on top by two. Williams. Hand out to Williams. J&J &J connection. All right, number six, Williams. Three for the lead. In and out. It could be out of bounds on New Orleans, though. Pelicans up by two. Boy, we got a lot of action going on with 6.43 to go. Okay, see, Blunder, I don't know. Hunger is so skinny, man. He is, but he's still physical, though. I, I still like his physical build. Um, you know, yeah, but he is skinny, though. But he did put on muscle from last year. He got a kickball. They had Wallace was wide open for a layup. Said they picked this just to the defense on him, though it was too late for them. They might have a key on how to control Dame offensively. Uh, not really. I, I think it's just every game is played different. So I wouldn't put too much stock on we just found a way to stop Dame Dollar. No. He just, you know, the game was already different. Williams, three for the lead. No good in and out. Pelicans rebound by Ingram. Ingram has it now. Down low to Valentunez. Going to post up on the left block. He's going to post up. Big body moves. Good pass to Marshall. Three. No good. Rebound by Williams. All right. And other Williams. Coast to coast. Lost the handle. Cookies. Stolen away. Pelicans basketball. Murphy has it. Pass to Marshall. Marshall. Top of the key. Was swinging out to Alvarado on the right wing. Give down low to Valentino. That's the free throw line. Pump fake. 
Spin to his left. Pass out to Marshall again. Crossover Marshall. Layup. Floater. No good. Rebound by the Thunder. With under six minutes to go now in the second quarter. I think SJ is trying to come back in the game. Step back. Williams for the tie. Got it. Tied at 33, ladies and gentlemen. Ingram driving to his right. Ingram all the way to the basket. Pass out to Marshall for three. Short. Wiggins rebound. Wiggins on the left wing. Swing out there to Williams. Hand off to other Williams. All right. He'll drive to the right side behind the back pass to Williams. Top of the key. Pass out to Dort for the lead. No good. Rebound by the Pelicans. All right. Valentine has a, a timeout called by the Pelicans. Timeout called with 5.07 to go. We're tied at 33. Man, what a game this is. I'm loving the pace. Loving the pace. It's up and down, back and forth. Very flashy. Got to respect that. Got to respect that. All right, let's see what's going on on the uh, Facebook side right now. Thank y'all for all showing love. I appreciate that, man. All right, we got some folks showing love on Facebook right now. Samuel Sagalas is watching right now. What's up, Samuel? Hey, hola, como están? Gracias. Thank you all for showing love. I appreciate that. Tied at 33, ladies and gentlemen. Got Todd. Miranda is watching. What's up, Todd? How you doing? And don't forget, we have our link is pinned. The link is pinned right now. Samuel says, gracias, amigo. De nada, amigo. We're in the building, y'all. Let's, let's rock and roll, man. Thank y'all so much, man, for showing love and being part of Uneducated Sports Talk. You guys are freaking awesome, man. We have a tie ball game at 33, Pelicans and Thunder. Every home team so far has won game one. Can the Thunder continue that streak, or can the Pelicans break that streak, man? We'll find out. Marthy B. LaSalle is watching. What's up, Marthy? Victor, Manuel Vasquez Perez is watching. Victor, hola, como están? Hola, Victor. Jamal Saad is watching. Hola, Jamal. Gracias. I got JJ Escorio Yopo is watching. JJ, gracias. Boy, so far, the physicality on both sides. But right now, Pelicans, if they want to continue this pace, that's how you're going to win these games. You have to play. OK City, very physical. You got to. Rodolfo Porosho Jr. is watching. What's up, Rodolfo? Ingram, 90-foot jumper. No good. Rebound by Wiggins. Wiggins is going to go ahead and give it out to SGA, who's back in the game now. 4.50 to go. SGA 
Top of the key. Pass out to Joe. Joe open. That's a spot, too. The three. No good. He missed him. Isaiah Joe is one of those guys. Oh, Ingram. Off the inbound pass. Good for the layup. Pedicans on top again by two. All right. Alexander is going to post up. Good pass to Dort. He'll swing out to Joe. Joe, I'm sorry, it's Wiggins. We'll find Williams open. Top of the key three. Got it for the lead. 35-36 now. Oklahoma City on top. B.I. will drive to his right. B.I. spins his left. Lost the handle, but he said he was fouled. Larry De Guzman. Larry De Guzman is in the building. Hola, Larry. Carmen Isidro is in the building. Hola, Carmen. Gracias. Thank y'all for showing love. I appreciate that, man. We're live, y'all. B.I. going to the line for two free throws. All right, shout out those on YouTube as well. YouTubers, Philly Philly says, David should be attacked. Holmgren is too small under the basket. You're right about that. And says, thank you, New Orleans, for taking good care of former UConn player Jordan Hawkins. Is Hawkins hurt or he's just been on the bench uh, the last month or two. Because he was a main player in the rotation at the start of the year. And KI Sports said, good night, everyone. Good night, Ann. Good night, Ann. Hope you have a beautiful rest of your night. All right, both free throws are made, by the way. 37. 36 your score. Holmgren passes out to SGA. Being guarded by Larry Nance. Driving to his left. SGA step back. The shot is Oh, the bailout call. Larry Nance never bit. He never bit on that jumper. And the referee still called it. Man. So imagine if Zion is playing this game. Zion's a big bully. Yeah, he would have he bullied these fools, man. I'm telling you. I don't know. I, I, I don't like that call. I don't like that call. But they still called it, though. And Marie Elizabeth Rose Velowski. I love the last name, Velowski. I love Velowski. That's just an awesome last name. I, I'm just, I'll call you Miss V. What's up, Miss V? Do they call you Miss V, Ann? Do they call you Miss V? I'm going to call you Miss V. That's cool. If not, let me know. Tell me I'm being very disrespectful, and I'll stop. All right, both free throws made. So Thunder back on top by one. 38-37. Here we go. All right, Ingram will drop to his left. Ingram blocked by Holmgren. Get that ish out of here. It's a block party. And Ingram's invited. Chet Holmgren came out of nowhere and just molly about that basketball. Hey, get off me. Larry Nance now a hand off to McCollum on the right wing. Good pass to Nance. Easy one-hand slam. What a pass by McCollum. You're patting pick and roll. 39-38. All right, here comes SGA now with the basketball. SGA driving. He'll come back out in the right wing. They got three guys on him. SGA pass out to Dort. Dort in the lane. Layup. No good. He blew the layup. But Holmgren with the rebound. And now they'll swing it out to Joe. Go on baseline. Joe. Reverse layup. Good. Back on top by the Thunder now. 40 to 39 with 240 to go. Thunder on top by one. Larry Nance now for the Pelicans has it. Crowd going crazy. And here comes Ingram, top of the key. Ingram is fouled by Lou Dort. <laughs> SSPS, do not mind the nickname. All right, Ms. V. 
Got you, Miss V. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> We have 33 likes, y'all. We need two brave souls to smash that like button to get us to our goal of 35 plus likes. Thank you all for smashing that like button. We need two brave souls to get us to 35 plus likes, man. You guys are awesome. Dark says, who do you think is going to win it all in the NBA playoffs? Right now, my money's on Denver. Back-to-back -back champs. That's my money right now. Ingram, fade away. No good. Jones, sky high, but he got undercut by Joe. So it's a foul on the Thunder. Is that more free throws coming up now? What a game we got going on. This is my kind of game. Both these teams playing hard. Both these teams playing great defense. B.I. fade away for the lead. Got it by Ingram. Pales back on top by one. 41 to 40 with two minutes to go in this second quarter. Alexander driving to the right. Step back. Jumper. Block from behind. It's going to be Pelicans basketball. It goes out of bounds on the Thunder. Pelicans basketball. 41 to 40 is your score. What a game we got going on. Welcome, Facebook family. Hola, gracias to all my folks from Mexico and beyond. Good pass, Murphy. Corner three open. No good. Rebound. SGA. Alexander. Pass on to Joe. Open three. No good. But a long rebound going to Wallace. And the Thunder will get a fresh 14. Alexander. Drop this left step back. Free throw line jumper. No good. Rebound, New Orleans. And here comes Herb Jones. All the way. But it's poked away out of bounds. Mike said, man, I'm itching to watch both NHL and NBA playoffs games, bro. It's good, man. Uh, Courtney says, Denver, and I hate to say it, but Boston meeting the finals. And that's my pick right now is Denver and Boston. Ever since. Well, shit, that was when Giannis went down, man. But. The way the Bucks have been playing the last man, two months or so, well, all season, they're like that. Are they really a championship team? But that game one really might have changed my mind again because the whole entire time I said Bucks and the uh, Nuggets. But, man, I'm, I'm going to go with Nuggets and the Celtics for now. But you're, uh, you're right, though, uh, Courtney. I'm going to go with Nuggets and Celtics. Oh, Joe lost the handle. Turnover. Pelicans basketball. McCollum says, let's slow it down, y'all. Let's slow it down. Sam says, bye. Good night, y'all. Good night, Samuel. All right, McCollum will drive to his left. McCollum step back. Three for the four-point lead. No, they don't get it. Rebound by Joe. There's a 10-second difference. Game clock, shot clock. Holmgren will pass out to Wallace. Corner three. Got it by Casey and Wallace. That was a huge shot. And the Thunder back on top by two. All right. Two second difference. Game clock, shot clock. Murphy has it on the left wing. Murphy being guarded by Alexander. Will drive to his right. Murphy. JV for the tie. Got it by Valachunas with 4.2 to go. They'll give it to Williams at the buzzer for the lead. No good. Y'all, we were tied at 17 at the end of one, and now we're tied at 43 at the end of two. We are going to halftime with a tie score, y'all. Let's get it. 43 to 43 is your score. What a game we have in store for the second half. Thank you all for the love and the support, man. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button, you guys, if you're new to the channel. And let's get a word of advice from our guy, Mr. Hashtag Bobby Rubin. What's up, what's up, USC Nation? It's your boy, Bobby Rubin. This one's for you. Drink responsibly.
hashtag Bobby Rubin. It is Sunday night, and I know we are sipping on something, right? Hashtag Bobby Rubin. It is halftime. Ladies and gentlemen, what are we sipping on? Let your boy know in the chat. Facebook, what are we drinking on? What are we drinking? What are we drinking? Facebook, what are we sipping on? Let me know. Twitter, what are we sipping on? The beautiful Courtney Thomas says, finally a good game today. Yes, ma'am, because these games have been all blowouts pretty much. Pretty much, man, been all blowouts. But, hey, what I'm going to say about the blowouts, though, is, is every team besides the tournament teams or the playing tournament teams, they've, they've been off for a while, right? So not real-time action. So that game, game two for every series is going to let me know how each team is going to bring it. Right? Game two. Game one is kind of funky, right? Long layoff. Not that much going on when it comes down to competition to keep you rocking and rolling. I'm going to place it on. You know what? We had a long layoff. All these teams, five, six days. You know, it took a while. Whatever. Let's get it, man. We got... Oh, no. I said, uh-oh. Half time, and we've only seen half of the shine. <laughs> Let's go, man. RC says, I just want to see Reese and Clark play with their new teams in person. That's going to be pretty damn soon. I'm excited for both those uh, females. And, y'all, we're part of the madness as well. We're going to call a bunch of Indiana Fever games, right? We're going to call a bunch of those games. So, sorry. I'm, I'm on the Caden bandwagon now. I want to show some love to women's sports. And Caden has brought that. I mean, I feel like I've called games already without Caden Clark, but still. You know, but now, I want to really get these people's interest into the WNBA. You know? So, hopefully I can play my part to do that. Uh, let's see. Uh, RC says, uh-oh, halftime. We've only seen half of the shine. That's right. Michael Kenji Izumi says, hashtag Bobby Ruben sipping on some lemon twisted tea. Twisted. Sip it on some twisted tea. Sip, tip it on some tip. Sip it on some twisted tea. Uh, Finney says, let's go, pals. We still in it. Yes, sir. IP in the building. Finney said, what's an IP? Smash that like button. I people you haven't already, bro. B-Dog Boys is hashtag Bobby Ribbon sipping on some OJ on the orange juice. Sip it on some OJ. Sip, tip it on some tip. Sip it on some OJ. So, I really hope game two will be much better. Game ones are, ugh. I mean, the Knicks and the Sixers played a good game one. The Lakers and Nuggets had a good game one. Um, uh, The Cavaliers and Magic had a good game one. Right? Don't let those final scores, like, really throw you guys off. A lot of those games were blowout toward the end. Now, talk about today's games. Yeah, Heat uh, got smashed by the Celtics. Pacers got smashed by the Bucks. And then, uh, yeah, the, you know, Mavs got smashed by the Clippers. I get all that. So, though, but but yesterday's games were pretty, were pretty decent. Pretty decent. Um, I'm missing one game. I, I forgot. I'm missing one game. I'm missing one game. Cordy says, what you sipping on, Los? I am sipping on some actual hashtag Bobby Rubin, you guys, which is Wild Cherry Pepsi and uh, Crown Apple. So, thank you, Courtney, for asking me that. I'm sipping on Wild Cherry Pepsi and Crown Apple. Now, Courtney, what are you sipping on, love? I've got my Wild Cherry Pepsi and Crown Apple, a.k.a. the hashtag Bobby Rubin. And you can't steal that because I already have it trademarked. Sorry, you guys. Can't steal it. <laughs> Butterfly says, hey, everyone. What's up, Butterfly? We, hey, we're just one like away, y'all, from our goal of 35 plus likes, y'all. One like away. I want to thank y'all for doing that. Man. And we just hit halftime. So you know we're going to kill it. You know we're going to kill it. Tied at 43. What are we sipping on? Hashtag Bobby Rubin. Do not be shy. Do not be shy. Let's see what's going on in our multi-stream verse. I like saying that. Our multi-stream verse. What's going on over there? Yo, Stephen Taylor says, show us the game. Stephen Taylor, I cannot. That's why it's live commentary and play-by-play -play reaction because I cannot show the game for copyright reasons. But Stephen Taylor, if you want to, come on to the channel by clicking on that link I sent. It's pinned. 
It's in the pinned message right now. Click on that link and uh, come subscribe to the channel. Have uh, cash prizes and giveaways galore. And of course, the best damn live commentary and play by play on social media. No BS on that one. No BS on that one. So sorry I can't show the game, Stephen Taylor. But Stephen Taylor, man, do me a favor, man, represent your ride or die squad. Who is your ride or die squad? I don't care what team it is. I don't care what sport. I don't care if it's high school, college, or pros. Represent your ride or die squad, Stephen Taylor. Let's go. Let's go. And we got ladies' hashtag Bobby Rubin sipping on some Jack and Coke. Couldn't resist. I don't blame you. Sip it on some Jack and Coke. Sip. Tip it on some tip, sip it on some Jack and Coke. Laney, when was the first time you had Jack and Coke? And uh, how long you been drinking it? And why is that your favorite go-to drink? Cordy says, not sipping on nothing no more. I drunk everything watching Miami get smacked. Oh, no. Oh no! Sorry about that, love. Yeah, it was it was semi decent in the first quarter, and after that, it was all she wrote. I got Kim Escabante. Hola, Kim. We got Jordan Garrett watching. What's up, Jordan? We got Greg Howard in the building. You guys, if you want to come join our uh, channel on YouTube, click on the pin message. You guys, hit that pin message and come join Uneducated Sports Talk for your chance at. Cash prize and giveaways galore. And, of course, the best damn live commentary and play-by-play. Beat Dog Boys, he's a Lakers and Niners guy. Yes, sir. Greg Howard, represent your ride-or-die squad, Greg Howard. Jordan Garrett, represent your ride-or-die squad. Let your boy know in the chat, man, and welcome to Uneducated Sports Talk. Uh, but yeah, gracias, hola, como están? Tuck the puppies is hashtag Bobby Rubin sipping on some orange crush soda. I had it in a little minute. That sounds pretty good. It sounds refreshing. Sip it on crush soda. Sip, tip it on, tip, sip it on crush soda. Let's get it, man. Sip it on the orange crush soda. Butterflies and red, 33 likes. Let's go, y'all. Smash the like button. We need, on my end, one brave soul to hit that like button to get us all go to 35 plus likes. Thank y'all for that, man. You guys are awesome, man. I got Aura. I let Nostri show and love. Noel, Provido, Rana. Gracias, Noel. Lattice, I was around 17 when I drank it the first time in the world, but I just love the taste of it, so I've been drinking it for over 30 years or more, I guess. Ha! <laughs> Let's go, Laney! Yes, ma'am. It just has the right umph to it, right? The the right ingredients for you. Hey, I, I can't I can't uh knock you on that. I've been now really sipping my hashtag Bob Rubin for about six years now. Wild cherry Pepsi and uh and Crown Apple. That 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 combination is just so damn good. So damn good. Uh, Paolo Sionson is watching. And that Kyle Titing is watching as well. And guys said six fans got a major scare when B went down in game one. Glad he's fine. And B goes down like three times a freaking game like that, bro. I don't know who's worse. Embiid or Anthony Davis. When they go down, you always hold your breath. <gasps> Whew, they good. Okay, all right, all right. I got whiskey is watching. What's up, whiskey? Texas Cowboys, Renegades, and Stars. That's his ride or die squads. I feel you on that, man. Said the Cowboys part though. I'm sipping this last drink like like it's it's, it's gone. It's it's it's, it's, gone. it's gone. It's gone. Tied at 43. What a game we got going on, man. My only issue, and now, someone, so Shannon Sharp has said the Thunder might be the worst number one seed in the history of the NBA playoffs. And I have to God, disagree with that. These guys won 57 games. I'll tell you what number one seed I really like was the Atlanta Hawks back in, uh, oh, my God, I don't want to lie to you. Was it 2015? 
when they had Kyle Culver, Horford, um, Paul Millsap. Uh, was Jeff Teague off the bench on that on that team? Who was the point guard for that team? But they, they had their five guys all go to the All Star game, right? Or their four guys, I forgot who it was. But that was not a really good number one seed. I, I just knew that they were number one. And the Cavs with LeBron were like number four, and they beat the crap out of them. <laughs> of course, it's not like the cut Bennett. It's Bennett for about uh, at least 15 minutes. You're right about that. I just keep trying to get the last little bit of it. <laughs> it's, it's bad. Lord A. Prince, Profoss is watching. What's up, Lord A? How you doing, love? Hola, como están? Yeah, but you're right, though. It, it's gone. At least the 15 Hawks went to the East Finals. Did they go? Was, was that the, was that them? That wasn't. Then they got beat by the Cavs. That one four matchup, which is the second round. Did the Hawks go to the final, East Finals against who? Cavaliers. Eighty always has glass bones and. Ligaments, yeah, yeah, we're all used to that. Even when he played for the Pelicans, I was like, man, every time he goes down. Worst number one team for me was Dallas in 07 against the Warriors. But before that, we didn't think that they would get beat like that. The Thunder, I kind of got to agree as far as the worst number one seed. I mean, they won 57 games, so I really can't. There's got to be another bad number one seed out there. And, not, and let's not talk about the team that actually got beat by number eight teams. Let's talk about the actual regular season before that. Clippers won without Kawhi. Wow, this is butterfly. Yeah. Clippers, hey, man. Clippers look good. Clippers look good. I ain't going to BS you guys. Yes, they were swept by the Cavs in the Eastern Conference Final in 15. Man! So they made it to the finals then. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's go, man. Hashtag Bobby Rubin. What are we sipping on? Let your boy know in the chat. What are we sipping on? I got to find me uh, something to sip on right fast, y'all. So I'm going to come right back and get some more of my drizzy drink so I can visit thank. <laughs> Let's go. One more like away from 35 plus likes, y'all. Thank y'all for that, man. Let's get it. So that Courtney can stop clowning me about my empty cup right fast. I, I need to go ahead and get some of my cup right fast. All right, y'all. Hey, um, ask PJ anything my girl might just answer. So be careful. Hold it down, PJ.
BJ. All right, y'all. We're going out to the second half, ladies and gentlemen. Going to the second half of this awesome matchup so far. Start of the third quarter. It'll be Thunder basketball. All right, Williams will drive to the lane. Floater, no good. Pass, oh, there's a pass to Ingram, uh, Holmgren instead, and it's going to be no good, though. Showtime now has the most home runs by Japanese-born player with 176 home runs, passing Hideki Matsui in the process. Damn! They ain't taking long at all, huh? Oh, we just reached our goal of 35 plus likes. We're at 36 now. Let's go. Ingram, Herb Jones, three, in and out. Rebound by SGA. Thank y'all for reaching that goal of 35 plus likes. Let's get to 40 now, y'all. Holmgren for three in the lead. No good. But rebound by the Thunder. Giddy, three in the lead. Nope. Rebound by Ingram. Good pass to the opener. Jones, corner three. No good. He missed it badly. SGA will get it now. He'll push it. Slow things down a little bit. Take better shots too, right? SGA drive the lane. Lost the handle. Layup. No. Blew the layup. Oh, good pass, Murphy to Valentunez. The lip is good. The Pelicans score the first points. All right, Giddy now on the left wing. Giddy will drive to the right. Giddy all the way to the basket. Lost the handle, but rebound by Williams. Williams. Oh, they, they did the clock wrong. It's supposed to be a fresh 14 instead. Dort, three in lead. Got it by Lou Dort. And the Thunder on top by one. 46 to 43 your score. To 45, excuse me. JV. Oh, lost the handle. Out of bounds on Valentunez. It was out of bounds. Forty-six to forty-five is your score. All right, Williams crossover, drop to the left. Williams step back jumper at the line, got it by Williams. Got to be the most underrated number two player on his team, right? The most underrated. No one ever talks about Williams. Ingram fadeaway, got it, tough shot. Boy, that mid-range game nasty for Ingram right now. Williams, top of the key, Williams. It's going to drive in the lane, Williams. Bad pass to Ingram, Holmgren, excuse me. He'll knock it to SGA, left wing. It's going to try and jab step. Now drive in the lane, fade away, shot up and air ball. Air ball. Pelicans basketball down by one. McCollum driving to his right. CJ pass out to Murphy, deep three. Got it by Trey Murphy. That's his style. The deeper the better, man. No ditty. <laughs> and we got a timeout called. Timeout called by the Pelicans. Thank y'all for showing love. I appreciate all the love and support, man. Let's get 40 plus likes now. Boom, we got it. Thank you for helping us reach our goal of 40 plus likes. Let's rock and roll with it, man.
So we need four brave souls to smash that like button to get us our goal of 40 plus, y'all. So I want to thank y'all for that, for helping us reach our goal of 30, 35 plus already. Now, can we get to 40 plus likes? That'd be freaking awesome. All right, we got some folks in the chat right here from Facebook. Let's say what's up to them. And guys, as well, Sixers next game one was good until MB got hurt. Joel Plutinia is watching. What's up, Joel? Got Joel watching. Hola, como están, Joel? Jesse Balisi. Hola, Jesse. Rolson Delay is watching. What's up, Rolson? Courtney says, wild cherry Pepsi and crown apple sounds weird. Well, I'm down to try it, though. Let's get it. Let's get it. Wild cherry Pepsi and crown apple sounds weird. <laughs> but it's so good. It is so good. Starlin, Quato is watching. What's up, Starlin? Hola, Starlin. Cash what's the worst number one team for me was Dallas, man. I'm trying to think. I got to actually look in the archives. What was the worst number one overall seed uh, in, in, the, in, in the conference, right, to play? All right, Williams, three. Got it! The Thunder back on top by Uno. Fifty-one to fifty, you score a thunder on top of one. JV in the left block, hook shot, too strong. The tip back in, he cannot get it. another rebound. We got a, oh, we got some grown men action going on. Williams and JV, Valentunas picked up Williams like he was a little kid, man. It tells you how strong JV is. Good God Almighty. Michael says, former Bengals linebacker Jordan Evans announced his retirement earlier. Okay, hey. Guys got to go and they got to go. Lito, Nunez, Marcavo is watching. John, Kevin, Quinza is watching. What's up, John? Hola, John. Hola, Norberto. We got a jump ball between Williams and JV. And it'll be jumped out. The Thunder with a tip. SGA, Coaster, Coast all the way for the layup. God! 53 to 50 years score. Thunder fans going crazy. What I'm seeing ain't no black folks in Oklahoma City. And we got an offensive charge called on the Pelicans. Gabby for Taylor's is watching. Hola, Gabby. Ah, uh, yeah, ain't no black folks out there in OK City. I don't see a black dot in them, in them stands. <laughs> oh, man, that's so funny. All right, Thunder getting out of the crowds, chanting OK City. Holmgren, drive the lane, spins his left, fade away. Got it by Holmgren. All of a sudden, out of Thunder on a nice little run. 7 0 run. 55 to 50 is your score. Crowd going crazy. Coach. Ooh, time out, coach. Ooh, I can't breathe. What's going on? They were so young. We had them on the roast. Zion, where you at, coach? We need a timeout.
call a timeout. 55 to 50 to score. Thunder on a 7 nothing run. Fifty-five to fifty is your score. What a game! We got Renee. Austin Bowl is watching. JJ Scotto Yopo. Hola JJ. I know you heard the news, but Roman Gabriel, the first great Rams quarterback, passed away yesterday. I did not hear that. I'm sorry, I did not hear that. Or maybe I didn't just overlook it because I didn't know who he was, but. Because I'm usually on top of all that kind of stuff. <laughs> but yeah. Uh that's 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 life, man. We all we are all living to eventually die, man. This is the sad part, right? You know. But as long as you live that life to the fullest, man, that's all that matters. Whether you live, you know what I'm saying? As a kid, you, you, you die as a kid, die as a teenager, or grown, or grown up in your 20s, your 30s, your 40s, even in your 50s and 60s and 70s, 80s, and the ones that are lucky to make it to 80 and 90 and, you know, in the 100s, you got to live your life to the fullest, man. You do. Jonas Aborio Villacruces is watching. What's up, Jonas? Hola, Jonas. Melchor Tata is watching. Melchor Tata. Hola, Melchor. Gracias. Thank y'all for showing love, man. Twitter game. What's up, Twitter? How y'all doing on Twitter, man? I love me some Twitter action. You guys are awesome. Hit me with your best shot. Fire your way. <coughs> Guy says he was an NFL MP in 1969 and the first quarterback of Filipino American descent. Oh, I did not know that. That's awesome, bro. All right, let's rock and roll. Shelby, Minnie says, love you. What's up, Shelby? Love you too, girl. Or live you. You said live you. So my bad if you just said live and not love. I'm sorry. Murphy, open for three. Corner three. Oh, that ball got stuck between a hard place and the rim. <laughs> Shelby, this one's for you, love. Sco. 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 That's for you. Shelby Minnick is in the building showing love. They go ahead now, jump ball it up, and it's going to be one by the Thunder. So Valentunas cannot catch a break with those jump balls. Williams on the right wing. Williams passes out to SGA in the corner. Crossover on McCollum. Step back jumper. Got it by SGA. He's in his bag now. SGA's in his bag. And when he gets going, good luck. Ingram. Bad pass to Jones. Out of bounds. 9-0 run by the Thunder. 57 to 50 is your score. Crossover Williams. Good pass out the doors. Doors. Better pass to Giddy. Corner three. Oh, no good. Rebound by the Pelicans. Crowd would have went crazy.
All right, and we got a pass out to Ingram. Top of the key. He'll drop to his left. Ingram, floater, tough shot over the outstretched Holmgren. Airballed it, and it's going to be SGA. Pass out to Giddy. Giddy on the left wing. It's going to post up and lay him up, and it's good using the big body. 59 to 50. We have an 11 0 run now for the Thunder. That's Giddy's first points of the game, by the way. Shelby says, thank goodness, thank you for being real. Shelby, I got you, love. McCollum, layup. Got it. It'll stop that 11 nothing run. Sheesh. 59 to 52 is your score. McCollum has 11 points now. Here comes Williams on the right wing. Crossover, Williams. Passes out to Dort. Corner three. Oh, in and out. Rebound by the Pelicans. Crowd would have just went crazy on that one. Ingram. Murphy. D3. Splash. Got it by Murphy. Fifty-five to fifty-nine is your score, and a drive. SGA layup, missed it, but he's fouled. Shelby, it's always good to see you, love. It is always good to see you. Not even gonna stunt on that. It's always good to see you, Shelby. At the line for one more, it's going to be SGA. He'll make both free throws, a six-point lead now. 61 to 55 is your score. All right, and we've got Jones pass to Murphy. Two and slam. Murphy, right place, right time. Sixty-one to fifty-seven is your score. Williams all the way to the line. The shot blocked. Got his own rebound back. The layup. Good. Way to stick with it, my brother. Way to stick with it. Sixty-three. To 57, your score now. Six point lead. Larry Nance Jr., top of the key. Hand out to Alvarado. Alvarado, nowhere to go. We're going to try and pass it out to Ingram. He will get the Ingram. Oh, they said a foul called on Williams. Oh, don't do that, ref. Don't do that. David Martinez. David Martinez. Hola. Good to see you, man. Como estan? Ingram. Pass on to Murphy. D3. No good. Rebound by Kimmick Williams. He'll get out to Jay Williams. Williams has it now on the right wing. And he'll find SGA top of the key. SGA. Step back. 14-footer. That's nothing but the net right there. That is his game. 65 to 57. The biggest lead of the day for the Thunder. Eight points. And Murphy layup is good. Good pass. Good find, by the way. 65. Have you seen Jokic wear it as Gru on his people meet? Yes, I did. I did. It, it, it kind of looks just like uh, Gru, honestly. He's kind of built like it, you know. All right. <laughs> it kind of talks like him, too. All right, SJ now, top of the key. Double team, he'll find Williams open for three. Oh, in and out. Rebound goes to nobody. Say a foul on the Thunder. Oh, oh sorry, foul on the Pelicans, excuse me. Day two, Amen Go is watching. What's up, that two? Or day two? Shelby says, you're always announcing and giving the necessary game calls. Shelby, we're in there, love. We are in there. That's what we do. That's what we do. You guys have a man hit that share button. Share this stream to all of your social media platforms. I appreciate that. That is what we do, Shelby. And thank you for recognizing real. 
Layup blocked. McCollum has now three on three. McCollum lost the handle, but got it right back. Going to go to the top of the key. Says, hold up. Wait a minute. Screen. McCollum pass it to Murphy. Murphy on the right wing. Pass it back to McCollum by the logo. He's swinging out to Murphy. Murphy's got a guy open, but he can't see him. He didn't find him. Back to McCollum. Driving to his right. McCollum now going left. Floater. Tough shot. No good, but rebound by Larry Nance. The putback is good. 65-61 for 3.04 to go in this third quarter. SGA now drives to his left. SGA layup. No good. Too strong. Rebound by Larry Nance. They say a foul call. Since I really can't see him as Gru now. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Despicable Me Too. One of the funniest cartoons I've ever seen in my life. I like Despicable Me, the first one. But number two, I was the most grownest man. In that, I was the most grownest man. In that dang old movie theater. Laughing my butt off at Despicable Me 2. I love that movie so much. It's one of my favorite cartoons. Part 3 was not good. I ain't gonna lie. Part 3 wasn't good. Alright. I'm right on 3. Got it by Jose. 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 All right, Hayward now. Thunder on top by one. SGA crossover. Good pass out to Hayward. Better pass to Joe. Joe, 70 foot jumper. Missed it badly. Rebound. No one out of bounds on the Thunder. So now the Pelicans. Once down by eight. It's only a one point game now. Matthew Levy Tuto. Show love. Pelicans on a 7-0 run and can take the lead right here on this possession. McCollum on the left wing. Crossover. Driving to his left. McCollum. Good pass to Larry Nance. Layup. Got it. And one. They caught an and one on that thing. Sixty six to sixty five. Just like that, the Pelicans on a nine oh run their damn selves. All right, here come Williams now. Williams hand off to Wallace. Wallace, good pass to Williams. Easy layup. The Thunder back on top by one to stop that run by the Pelicans. Marshall has it. Marshall, Marshall, Marshall. He'll drive to the right, nowhere to go. Top of the key with a minute and a half to go in this third quarter. Marshall driving left, layup, and no good. Rebound by SGA. He's going to push it all the way to the rack. Layup, good by SGA. Everyone's favorite nasty number, 69 to 66. Alexis Pinuela is watching. What's up? Hola, Alexis. Giselle May Bayer is watching. Giselle, hola. All right, drive it in. Floater by McCollum. He got it in there. Squeeze the orange. 69 to 68, your score. One point lead for the Thunder with 40 seconds to go in this third quarter. And he lost the handle, but the foul caught him up on the Pelicans. All I hear is my daughter in the background saying, period. I don't know what she all hyped about. She like, period. <laughs> she talking about her, her little uh, friends. She said, period. <laughs> Thank y'all for hitting that like button, man. We are at uh, 37, 38 likes, excuse me. Joe lost the handle. Joe drops his right. Joe passed out to Williams. Williams going to his left. Williams floater. Got it. Seventy one to sixty eight your score.
Three-point lead. Alvarado will drive the line. Euro step blocked by Gordon Hayward. Get it out of here. 11 seconds left. And a pass on the Joe. Corner three. Got it by Isaiah Joe. 74 to 68 to score. And turnover on the Pelicans with point eight. So the Thunder will have another shot at glory. A 9-2 run by the Thunder all of a sudden. The Pels had took a 66-65 lead since that time. It happened so quick. A 9-2 run by the Thunder. And, oh, the uh, I like this, though. The Thunder call a timeout. They want to run a play for this .8 seconds. I like that, though. Let's, really, let, let's get a really good shot, man. We have enough timeouts toward the end. We have enough shots to in now. We need two brave souls from the YouTube community to hit that like button, y'all. A thumbs up. Thank y'all for uh, showing us some love. I appreciate that, man. And I promise you guys, all my XFL lovers, football lovers, I promise you, this weekend, we're going right back to the XFL because we would have called enough basketball games <laughs> to, uh, you know, to go ahead and give love for the weekend to the XFL. So, yes, uh, we're going back live next week for the uh, UFL. I said XFL, I'm sorry, the UFL. We'll call at least two games next weekend for the UFL. Promise you guys that. But let's not get it twisted, y'all. We got Tuesdays with TJ, our NFL podcast, the NFL podcast is Tuesday coming up to, uh, tomorrow. We're calling the Knicks versus 76ers game two. Sixers at Knicks game two. Point eight to go. Giddy. It's going to pass it to Chet Holmgren. The buzzer is blocked. It's blocked. All right. At the end of the third quarter, the Thunder take a six point lead. 74 to 68. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going now to the fourth and final quarter. Let's rock and roll. Going to quarter number four. If you're new to the channel, new to the stream for the first time, do your boy a favor, man. Put a four in the chat, y'all. Ready, PJ? Yeah? Put a four in the chat. Put a four in the chat. Put a four in the chat, 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 chat. It's the fourth quarter, y'all. Put a four in the chat. Winners become losers. Losers become winners, you guys. Uno, dos, tres. Cuatro, 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 cuatro. Cuatro. Put a four in the chat, y'all. Let's get it. Uh, I can't believe that the NFL draft is this week. Yeah, it is, bro. This, it is Thursday. And I will be live from the Come On In Sports Network. The brand new network you guys will see me on. Let's go. Thank y'all for showing up. We'll go. I'll post a lot more of that too in the up and coming days, you guys. But you see me, PJ, and TJ a part of that, along with Coach Rock and Dolph Seventeen from the Keep It Real Who That Sports podcast, and the big homie Zach and Nonfiction from Real Fan Sports. All of us are going to collab for this one channel called the Come On In Sports Network. Let's show some love on Thursday. I'm going to post it. I want everyone to be a part of this. Please, 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 please be a part of it. It'll be dynamic, y'all. Wilbur Dana is watching. What's up, Wilbur? Hola. We got a four in the chat by Infinity Productions. A four in the chat by B Dog Boy. A four in the chat by Michael Kinizumi. A four in the chat by RC. Four in the chat by the beautiful Shelby Minnick. Yes, ma'am. We got fours in the chats galore. Thank you all for the love support, man. And, uh, all right, as long as you're doing it, man, I'm doing it, bro. That's right, bro. I'm not playing no games. Tomorrow is going to be Sixers at Knicks. Tuesdays is Tuesday with TJ. Wednesday, I'll be off. I'll make sure I have a day off in between. Thursday is the NFL draft, obviously. Friday, more NBA action. Saturday and Sunday, the XFL, y'all. Or the, I'm sorry, UFL, my bad. The UFL, we're doing all that. So it's going to be a full week, one day off. It's going to be Wednesday. That's it. 
I might take Friday off too. I'm not gonna be this. I might take Friday off. I might take Friday off. I'm gonna take Friday off, so we'll see. All right, we're going to the fourth quarter, man. Let's get it. With me, Jimenez, David Martinez, Hola, David. Still can't get used to saying UFL. I'm telling you, man, I, I keep saying XFL. It's the UFL. I got it. Yeah, so UFL, not XFL. <laughs> You're right, man. It, it is tough, though. It is very tough. It is very tough to say the UFL, man. Fuda Selga is watching. Hola, Fuda. Alvarado now for the final quarter. Alley to Murphy is blocked. Get that crap out of here. Here comes Williams to Giddy. Giddy, floater, no good, but tempted by Ongren. The Thunder back on top by eight. Only has a double-double now. 11 points, 10 rebounds. Good cross-court pass to Marshall. Gone baseline, Marshall. Pass to Valanciunas. Hook shot. Got it. Nice touch by JV, too. All right, Joe. Uh, I'm sorry, it's Wiggins. Wiggins to Giddy. Giddy trying to find a cutter. Giddy. Really good at this, too. Pass out to Williams on the left wing. Screen from Holmgren. Williams got away with a travel. My goodness. Wiggins shot is up. And it's going to end one over JV. Wiggins going to the line for one more, ladies and gentlemen. I got Pharrell Kirkland. Showing love, for real. Represent your ride or die squad. I don't care what team it is. I don't care what sport. I don't care if it's high school, college, or pros. Represent your ride or die squad, my guy. And hit that link that's pinned. Come join us on YouTube, man. Hit that subscribe button for your boy. 797 is your score. Here we go. And McCollum driving in. Fade away. No good, but tipped in by a no. He missed a tip at JV. Got it again. He's fouled this time. Big body JV. Jonas Valanciunas is going to the line for two free throws. Uh, Vinny says, I'm glad they merged, though. It's way less confused with teams and stuff. Yeah, you're right about that. Mike says, Carlos, have you seen ERA of Blake Snell this season after his three stars? No, I have not. What is it? Wilson Daniel Sanchez Adams is watching. Carlos uh, Bora Galarcia Galarce. Carlos Galarce is watching. Hola, Carlos. Mi nombre es Carlos. Mi nombre es Carlos. Carlos Clayton. Jamal Side is watching. Hey, hola, Jamal. Welcome back, man. Welcome back. And Valentunas makes both free throws to make it 79 to 72 your score. All right, here we go. Williams, pass the home, and top of the key. Three. Got it! And the biggest lead of the day for the Thunder. Ten points. Holmgren. Big hungry right now. All right, Marshall will get out the JV. So face up on the left block. Post up now against Holmgren. About to eat him up. Down low. Pass out to Alvarado. Back to... Valentunez. Oh, bad pass. Oh, they say a foul. No. Luis Juarez Villas is watching. Hola, Luis. Hola, June Dizon. Eleven points. Eleven point five seven yards. Twelve Ks. Man, hold on. Is Blake Snell with the uh, Padres? 
And JV missed the free throw. Who is Blake Snell with? He's he signed this year to somebody with the Giants. I know he's having a rough path, but geez, yeah, that, that's bad so far. Is he with the Giants? It's not the Padres no more. I forgot. He, he got traded this year. Uh, he got picked up this year, like late in the right before the season started, I think. Octavio De La Cruz is watching. Hola, Octavio. Hola, June. June Layson. JV will make one out of two. All right, here we go. Holmgren has now dropped to his left. Oh, cookies! Stolen away, two on one. And now, pass to Murphy in the corner. Cross court pass to Najee Marshall. JV at the top of the key. Ingram back in the game now on the left wing. Hand out to Murphy. Murphy got away with a travel. Back to Murphy. D3 is the spot, though. Got it by Murphy. That's his spot. 82 to 76. Murphy loves that D3, bro. Dude's got range. Williams, great deep. Marshall, great defense. What a steal. Cookies. Chocolate chip style. Murphy, D3. Off the backboard, no good. That's what you call a heat check, though. That was a heat check. SGA layup, no good. Missed it. All right, Marshall now has to pass to McCollum. McCollum, right wing three. Got it by C.J. McCollum. We got a timeout called. Timeout called by the Thunder. 82-79. to 79. The Pelicans with a 7-0 run. We need a freaking timeout from the Thunder. Coach. Coach. <laughs> Two to 79 your score. Coach, we need a timeout, coach. 7 0 run by the Thunder, just like that. I mean, by the Pelicans, excuse me. Pelicans trying to be the first road team to win game one. Signed a two-year, $62 million deal, right? Colleen Marie, Perpetual is watching. What's up, Colleen? Arthur Sariano. Hola, Arthur. Jamie Jemmy is watching. Hola, Jamie. That Tony. Hola, that. That's right, Infinity. Coach! Coach! <laughs> Time out! 82 to 79. What roller coaster of events we got going on right now? Roller coaster of events we have going on. This is we still in it, baby. You can think, man, Troy Murphy, I mean, Trey Murphy, he does not care about range at all. This dude will shoot that bad boy all the way from Missouri into Oklahoma City. And if you're not familiar with the Pelicans, Trey Murphy is he's one of those he's one of those dudes, man. I know we have a very low chance to win this series, but winning game one against OK City is big. Well, I mean, you have a great chance to win this series. He has a great chance. Uh, the uh, the uh, Pelicans have a great chance to win this series. The Thunder are not your average number one seed. They're very, very, very young. Very young. I mean, from top to bottom. SGA is a beast. I love him. You know, but as far as what they do, like, super duper great, they're good at everything. They're not great at one thing. If that makes sense, right? They're just good at everything. 
those kind of teams you can kind of beat. It, but if you're the Pelicans, you must do this game one to really boost your confidence, right? Oh, RC, you're right about that. The Lakers and, and Darvin Ham was like, hey, we 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 really want to play the uh, Nuggets. Oh, oh, okay, okay, whatever. Lying. Want to play the Nuggets, my ass. Boy, I would have been like, let's play the Thunder. Because also, he's a reigning sign, you know, Cy Young winner. He won it last year when he was with the Padres. Yeah, yeah he was the beast for the Padres. All right, here we go. And uh, Williams, John Lane Williams, Florida, blocked by JB. And it's going to be Pelicans basketball. They can tie with a three right here in this possession. McCollum on the left wing. Down low to Ingram. Ingram going to post up on the left block. Face up now. Ingram drives to his right. Big body move. Up and under. Fade away. Don't pass to Marshall. Three. Tie. Oh, in and out. In and out. No good. Rebound by the Thunder with 8-19 to go. Plenty of time to go in this game. SGA driving. Nowhere to go. Najee Marshall, man, one of the best defenders in the game. Fade away by SGA. Good. Tough shot, man. What a tough shot. 84-79. McCollum, crossover, screen. McCollum going to his left. Good pass, but broken away by the Thunder. Good defense. SJ now all the way to the rim. Layup up, and it's no good. But it's a foul before the shot. All right, says, I, the Thunder went from the playing number one seed in, uh, uh, in a year time. Oh, and gee. Yeah, it, but it tells you the maturation, right? But also, with the same team, let's be real, the only name they actually added was Gordon Hayward, right? Uh, and that was via the trade deadline. So it, it just lets you know that they went from the playing tournament to the number one seed. They're not that different, right, besides of their, their mentality. But they can easily be beaten. But no, not because as number one seed, you still earn that bad boy. SGA3, in and out. Boy, BJ Marquez. Hola, BJ, Jeffrey, Cosisco. Hola, Jonathan, Zeta. Hola, Jonathan. Welcome to Uneducated Sports Star, Jerome Calabas. Hola, Jerome. JV, pass out to Murphy. Murphy, baseline. Back to Valachunez on the left block. He'll go out, hand off to McCollum. Back to JV. JV, pass to Ingram in the corner. Ingram, fade away. Lost the handle. Three, two, one. The three, the buzzer. No good. But tipped in by Troy, Trey Murphy. What a tipping by Murphy. Uh-oh. Do we got some pushing and shoving going on? Or am I just uh being real messy right now? Eighty-four, eighty-one. The Thunder on top by three with the basketball. Wiggins pass out to Dort. Dort pump fake. Dort draw the lane. Pass to Williams. Corner three. Got it by Williams, the Arkansas native. The other Williams. <laughs> the other Williams. 87, 81. Your score has a big three. The Thunder playing great defense. Here we go. Pelicans got it now. Draw the lane. McCollum lost it. Fade away. Oh, that's a man's man's fade away jumper. Eighty-seven to eighty-three your score. Four point lead. Here comes Williams. Top of the key. Screen. Williams. Driving to the right. Williams. Jumper. No good, but he's fouled by McCollum. Uh uh, Michael says, I knew the Lakers were pressured to win against the Pels because if they lose, they would have faced the Kings. And I knew the Kings had the Lakers number this season. That is also true as well. Yeah. Ray Anthony Afonso is watching. What's up, Ray Anthony? Hola. Hola, Ray. And Michael says, can you imagine USA versus Canada this year's Olympic basketball? Oh, it would be crazy, right? I can't wait. That's going to be a good matchup. Uh, I says, R. Kansas. <laughs> Williams missed the free throw. Can't be missing free throws. Uh-oh. 
can't be missing free throws. All right, here we go, and he'll make one out of two. Got a five-point lead. We have under six minutes to go now, halfway through this fourth quarter. Pelicans basketball, B.I. with it now. It's going to post up from the right wing, B.I. driving to his left. Good pass to Larry Nance, two-hand slam! Get out of the way. Larry Nance can jump for days. 88 to 85, your score. He finishes his brick. <laughs> Three-point lead, uh-oh. Boy, Williams driving to his left. Williams, layup. No good. Rebound by McCollum. CJ, they can tie with a three. Murphy for the tie. No good. Boy, he has a high arcing, beautiful rainbow shot, though. Ingram being guarded by Dort. It's good defense by Dort. Pass Herb Jones. Herb Jones. Oh, is there a penalty on the Pelicans? What happened? Jose Sanchez showing love. Jose, 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 Jose. B.I. Joe, says R.C. Says uh, you'll see low streams, auto racing, comp, cornhole, and pickleball next week. No, sir. Not doing that. SGA 3. In and out. Ooh. In and out, boy. That's tough. B.I. Has it. Oh, good crossover. Driving to his left. B.I. Going left. Jumper. No good. Short rebound by Alexander. 4.45 to go. SGA. Driving. Spin. Fade away. Blocked by Murphy. Get that crap out of here. It's a block party. SGA's invited. Slow it down. Some of the column. They're down by three with four and a half to go. They can tie with a three on this possession. Here we go. McCollum. Step back for the tie. No good in and out. McCollum. Missed it. Holmgren rebound. SA down the left wing says, let's slow it down, y'all. Let's get a good possession here. Got a screen. Oh, bad pass. He wanted Holmgren to cut in. He did not. He stopped on the dime. And you might need a timeout, though, if you're the Thunder. You might want a timeout. Just to collect your breath. I think they're all kind of tired right now. That's what it seems like. Yeah, there is a timeout, though. Good timeout by, I don't care if the Pelicans or the Thunder. They both needed a timeout in that situation. They both are kind of under their legs right now. Enrique Rodriguez. Hola, Enrique. If they had Zion healthy, the Pelicans might could really pull the upset. Probably, probably, but I'm not going to say that because even with Zion, Zion, man, has times where he just doesn't go crazy. Michael says, projected rosters for Canadian men's basketball team. SGA, Jamal Murray, R.J. Barrett, Dylan Brooks, Kelly Nick, Zach Eddy, Andrew Wiggins, Nikhil, Alexander Walker, and Lou Dort. That's going to be a nasty squad for Canada. Count me in. And you know that when these guys play for their country, they all become freaking superstars. Lanshiro Yao. Is watching. Nielsen. Afonso is watching. Hola, Nielsen. Let's get a good procession here. Proceed to throw it to the crowd. Yeah, right? <laughs> Douglas Perez is watching. Hola, Douglas. Como están? Everyone from Facebook. Gracias. From Twitter. Thank you. Gracias. And of course, my YouTube family. Thank y'all for showing love always, man. Let's get it, man. We got Ib. Christian is watching. Hola, Ib. Let's go. James Charlo is watching. Hola, James. Zion is elite going crazy. He is. He, or he plays terrible. Yeah. You're right. He's either going crazy or he plays like, oh, like, dude, what are you doing? Like, mind you, that first game against the uh, Lakers at the end, right, for the Pelicans to be the sixth seed, 
Zion had a dud. He went nothing. It was ugh. And then in the first, the, the next round for the uh, playing tournament, he scores 40 points. It's going crazy on the uh, Lakers. That same team where he was like, nah, I'm good. He said, oh, by the way, I'm going to proceed to be a beast in this game. Ariel Bobis Burrito is watching. Ariel, hola. Three-point lead. That was a good timeout call by whoever called that timeout because both these teams were breathing heavily. Noel Enriquez is watching. Elizadel Eric is watching. Thank y'all for watching and showing some love. I appreciate that. 88 to 85 your score. Boy, we got, I think it's under four to go now. So, JV with a 13-point, 20-rebound game. And we kind of knew that was going to be the story going into it. We kind of knew that was the story. We have 4-13. Four minutes and 13 seconds left to go in this game. Pelicans basketball. Asi is watching. Bernabe Sanchez is watching. Hola, Bernabe. Hola, Asi. Leonardo. Rex Bungosi is watching. Hola, Leonardo. 88-85, your score. Here we go. McCollum drives to the left. Good pass out to Jones for the tie. Got it by Herb Jones. We are tied at 88 with a three. Sixteen to six run by the Pelicans. Williams now top of the key pass. SGA pump fake. SGA drive the lane. Oh, stolen by Larry Nance. Cookies three on two and Ingram layup for the lead. Got it. Pelicans on top by two. A quick timeout call by the Thunder with three thirty four to go. Boy, 90 to 88 score. We got a timeout call. We said, Coach! <laughs> Coach! We need another timeout. The Pelicans got the lead now. What are we doing, baby? Coach! Timeout! Coach! I can't breathe! Ninety to eight eight your score, you guys. Finish says cookies. The Pelicans back on top by two. What a game. I knew this would be a good one to call. I knew it. Chad Lund is watching. Hola, Chad. Dennis Rodon Alvarez Ramos is watching as well. Let's go. Shout out to those in the chat, man. Showing love. You guys are awesome. Thank you all for the love support, man. Smash that like button. Where are we at the likes, though, by the way? Let me go ahead and check it out. Let me check it out. Where are we at, by the way? We're at 39 likes. We need one brave soul. SGA. Oh, bad path the door and out of bounds. SGA all of a sudden struggling now the last three or four possessions. He's been struggling. This is what Superstars is all about. We want to see it right here. Crunch time. Larry Nance now. Top of the key. Hand off to McCollum. And we got an offensive foul called on the Pelicans. Illegal screen by Herb Jones. We need one brave sword to smash that like button to get us to our goal of 40 likes, y'all. We need 40 likes. One like button, y'all. Thank y'all for the love and support. I appreciate that. When was the last time he had the lead? I think it was 66-65. Williams. Nowhere to go. Good defense by the Pelicans right now. Boy. Download a home grant. 
Fade away. Bad shot, though. You had a smaller McCollum on you. Oh, but Murphy couldn't handle the rebound. Out of bounds. Murphy lost the board. With 2.49 to go, Holgren had McCollum on him and decided to go with a fadeaway. He was smoking on Herb. Herb Jones. <laughs> oh, no, I lied. Larry Ness. Gave the ball to, uh, to Murphy while he was still out of bounds. That's Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Fresh 24 now for the Thunder. And it's been a while since Thunder has scored. SGA for the lead. Off the backboard. No good. Lost the ball. Pelicans. Out of bounds on who? On who? On who? SGA jump ball. With 239, SGA has got to calm down now. He's shooting threes and all type of, he's not getting back to his spot. So who was that actually out of bounds on? And we got uh, maybe a challenge. Are they going to challenge it? I think the Thunder will challenge it. That's a good, a good challenge, in my opinion. I wonder if SJA's quad injury late this season have affected his overall play in this playoff. No, it has not. It has not. He was just balling earlier, but now in this fourth quarter, he just, you know, with the playoffs, man. It's the freaking playoffs. Here we go. I said, this game is so wild right now, right now. Yes, sir. You just want to smash that light button. We need one brave soul to hit that light button. I can tell you, still not 100% by the way Shea is doing. I'm not, I just think it's this really good defense by the Pelicans, honestly. I think they're, they're, they're crowding the space, but it's up to him to make the right play. You know, sometimes you just can't dribble, 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 dribble. Sometimes you got to dribble and throw that ball out. He already has three eyes on him. That's fine, right? Pass that ball. Pass that ball. This is that OKC experience, inexperience for you. Yeah, yeah, this is, yeah. Oh, this might come back and haunt the Thunder, though. This might be out on Holmgren. I know the Thunder won the challenge, which I appreciate the challenge because you don't want to jump ball and determine that. Oh, that might be on Holmgren. That might just have been out on Holmgren. I don't know. My bet is home grid, but if they can't find any exclusive, you know, evidence, you got to go ahead and jump the ball up. If it's not a jump ball, it's going to be the Pelicans ball up by two. But if you're SGA, though, you got to make the right play. You can't force nothing right now. He's been forcing it the last four or five possessions. All right, says Lowe's, I know this is off topic slightly, but what you do, WBA games, life favorite games, ace games at some point. Oh, yeah. You got dog right, man. We doing there. We're going to do a bunch of those games, man. Oh, yes, sir. Caitlin Clark versus the world pretty much, man. I better just keep it real. All right, 
It's going to be Pelicans basketball. It was last touched by Holmgren. The right call. In hindsight, they are better. Hindsight, 2020, they're better off going with the jump ball. But I still respect the call, the, the challenge, because, hey, let's, let's get it. You know, but Pelicans ball with 240. They can now increase their lead to either three, four, or five on this possession. Maybe even six, depending on a four-point play. Just saying. Just throwing it out there. Boy, what a game we got going on with 2.40 to go. So what's the delay for? What's going on? There's a delay in the game right now. All right, I don't know what's going on, but guys are fussing and cussing and all kind of stuff. Here we go. Pelic is now with the basketball with a two-point lead with two and a half to go in this game. McCollum after the long delay. Good pass to Larry Nance. Nance, oh, he missed the dunk. Oh, rebound by the Thunder. They can tie with a two or take the lead with a three. SGA, step back. Nowhere to go. He'll pass it out to Williams. Back to SGA on the right wing. Now will be top of the key. And get the screen. SGA driving to the left. Step back. Crossover. Pass out to Williams. Uh, the Dort, excuse me, pump fake, Dort, floater, missed the, oh, he missed the floater. He had a bunny, and he missed it. Two minutes to go. Dort had, he should have shot the three, honestly. He was wide open for the three. I don't know why he pump faked. Oh, we got a foul call to SJ. That's a bad foul. That's a bad foul. Says, OKC okay, City fans booing, like, what is going to do, man? <laughs> just, just showing their frustration. All right, that was a foul to get, but that was kind of like, for what? It was Trey Murphy driving. 1.55 to go now. Ingram on the right block. Post up. Ah, yes, yeah, that's, that's a good call. Offensive foul, charge call. He put an elbow in it. There was no need for that, B.I. No need for the elbow. I mean, for the uh, shoulder. No need for putting the shoulder in it. It's been a long time. The Thunder haven't scored in a long time. But there was no need to put the shoulder into him, um, B.I. It was an obvious shoulder. And you guys got to know, just because you got a smaller guy on you, you don't need to be extra tough on that smaller person. You don't. Boy, the Thunder haven't scored a bucket in over five minutes. Now, this is crazy. <laughs> SGA, top of the key. He'll drive to his left. Jumper, elbow, got it for the tie. That's his shot, man. If he just slows down, that's his shot. We're tied at 90. Minute and a half to go. That's SSA shot, though. McCollum going to the left. Pass Larry Nance. Open, three. Herb Jones, no good. Rebound by the Pelicans. McCollum, three for the lead. Miss it again. Rebound by the Pelicans. Ingram will drop the lane. Good pass to Larry. Oh, they couldn't get it. Murphy pass to Ingram. Right wing three is a bad shot. But another rebound by the Pelicans. Four. Uh-oh. Did it hit the backboard or the, or the rim? Did it hit the rim? Wow. The Thunder cannot get a rebound to save their lives right now. Tied at 90. So many point blank looks from three. B.I. shot. That was just dumb. Why would you shoot that? A fadeaway three-pointer from the right wing? That's not his style. All right, 12 seconds on the shot clock now for the Pelicans. 
Tied at 90. We are now officially under a minute to go. McCollum. Good pass to Larry Nance. Larry Nance. Shot. Oh, blocked by Chet Holmgren. Get that crap out of here. Boy, the Thunder Canal take the lead of the possession. Tied at 90. There's 14 on the shot clock. Got to hurry up. Williams with the basketball. Screen. Williams. Uh-uh. There you go. They want SCA to have now. Five, four, three. SGA driving the lane. SGA floater. Got it. And one for SGA. Count it in there. One, two, and maybe three. Thunder fans going dumb right now. How did he get that shot off? And you can't challenge an N1. You can't. I don't know if there's a foul or not. I don't see the foul, but you can't challenge an N1. Thirty two point five. Chet the Rex says RC says uh, we're moving at a breakneck speed right now. It is thirty two point five to go. Ninety two to ninety is your score. SGA trying to give him a three point lead. That is what superstars are all about right there. And he made the end one and we might have a timeout call. Yes, a timeout call by the Pels. Says Shavante is him. Shavante sang. Oh, it says SGA has arrived. Land the plane, Los. Boy, hey, that's my guy, man. This is the guy I wanted to see. And he struggled. He did struggle. He did struggle for about five minutes. I ain't going to lie. So let's not act like that one shot had been going in. No, he did struggle about the last six or seven possessions. Very indecisive at times. 93 to 90 is your score. Thunder on top by three. Now, if you're the Pelicans, 32 seconds. Do you go for the game time three? Or do you go for maybe a quick two? Obviously, if you're open for three, take a three. But in my opinion, man, it is just get a best shot. If it says, I'm sweating right now. Uh-oh. Yes, sir. I bet you are, my guy. I bet you are. And what a block by Chet Hungry, man. That was a nasty block on Larry Nance. Said, give him the MVP trophy right now. That was a tough shot right there. But the game is not over. The Pelicans can tie with a three in this possession. Herb Jones will inbound it. He'll give it out to McCollum. Top of the key, McCollum. Screen from Murphy. McCollum going to his left. McCollum. Fadeaway jumper over Wallace. Got it by McCollum. All right, there is still a two-second difference. Game clock, shot clock. Williams, pass out to Dort, Dort to Holmgren, foul him, foul him, they fouled Holmgren, that's the one to foul, man, that's the one to foul, tough shot by McCollum, too, over the outstretched arms of Wallace, Holmgren, it's a decent free throw shooter, but very inexperienced. Give me the line right now. See what he does. Holmgren, first shot. Missed it. He missed it. The Pelicans have a chance. The Pelicans have a chance. All right. One more. And he'll make the second one. It's a 94-92 lead. Pelicans can tie with a two or take the lead with a three. We have 14 seconds left, y'all. Take, take. You can take your time now if you're the uh, Pelicans. You can take your time. 
but I'm always a big fan. If it's under five seconds, you go for the game-winning three. If you're the road team, you go for the game-winning three and get out of there, right? I'm That's my mentality. But right now it's 14 seconds, right? But if this play lasts beyond the five-second mark, you got to go for the, the game of... Uh, the game uh, winning three. There is a definite chance, Infinity Productions. A definite chance for you guys, man. Every home team has won so far in game one. Can the Pelicans stop that streak right here? Can they get the go-ahead three? Or will they go for the tie with the two? We'll find out on this episode of Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> this is, come on, pals. This is your moment. And who's going to take the shot? I'm going to go with McCollum. I think McCollum's been the hot hand the last, uh, you know, this fourth quarter. B.I. is not going to shoot a three. I can say that. But McCollum can hit the three and the two. So I'm probably going McCollum. Or do I set a player for Trey Murphy? I probably set a player for Trey Murphy for the game winning three. Here we go. Herb Jones will inbound the basketball. And Herb Jones, look out for him too. He might be open in the corner somewhere. McCollum now has it. Going to eat this clock up. Screen. McCollum. Driving on Wallace. McCollum. Lost the handle. Got it right back. McCollum for the win. No good. The Thunder will escape with a game one victory. McCollum had an open look. And could not put it in. That's your ball game. Thunder win 94 to 92. Boy, talk about a game. McCollum got stifled by Wallace. Case and Wallace did a damn good job of shutting down any kind of momentum that they wanted to do in that play. I don't like the fact that it was they waited way too long and McCollum lost it off his foot. Boy, that was game one. Of it. That was so close, man. RC, I agree. I would have got to Murphy, man. Some kind of way. Murphy would have been involved, man. Ah, what a game, though. If it is, damn it, man. What a game. Somebody had to win it. Somebody had to lose it, man. 94 92. Ladies and gentlemen, this is playoff basketball. Seven of the eight games being played this weekend, at least one team scored under 100 points, you guys. Or might have been six out of eight games. But still, it tells you that it's going to be tough defense played all this series, every series. Now, the low scoring could be the fact that teams had to wait five days to play a game. It could be that, too. But still saying... CJ missed his last three threes. Why he's still shooting them? Courtney, I don't understand. I thought Trey Murphy should have got that last look. But McCollum had the hot hand, though. So I knew that B.I. wasn't shooting a three. I knew that. B.I. ain't shooting no threes. So if B.I. got it, they're going for the tie. And I always said, under five seconds, go for the game winning three for the road team. That's how I feel because you don't want to go in overtime uh, with the crowd on, against you. That's how I feel. That's me personally. But as far as... Um, the shot, I, I don't like the play, though. I thought somehow they should have got the ball a lot faster than Trey Murphy than what they did. And McCollum, you know, just lost off his foot, and McCollum's not a point guard. I'm trying to tell folks that he plays the point guard position, but he's not a point guard. So, which means his handles aren't the extreme best for an NBA point guard to make something happen, right? He's not a blow-by-you kind of uh, guard at, at the point guard position. So, that right there, I would have had a, a quick screen. Either McCollum, it was screened for uh, Murphy. Murphy picks and pops, right? Or McCollum takes it all the way to the lane, step back, jumper for the tie. You got to be decisive what you want to do. But every team, all eight teams that were the home teams this weekend, won in game one. That's crazy how it goes down. That's why I tell you home court is so important in the NBA. Thank you, Courtney. You ain't got to go for the three uh, for the win. 
I think McCollum should have just went ahead and built it in because he's so much better at the mid-range game than the three-point game. So I thought McCollum should have went ahead and, you know, screened. And if they, you know, put a lot of attention on Murphy, McCollum, as a playmaker, driving that lane, go for the two and a tie. But, you know, he went for that three, and that was, that was all she wrote, man. That was all she wrote. Like I said, you still have game two pals. Yes, yes. McCollum was struck by hero syndrome. That is true. <laughs> I need a hero. <laughs> Just steal that game and they'll be fine. But they did not, man. This was 90s basketball tonight, says RC. Well, 90s basketball. Let me tell you about 90s basketball before we get out of here, y'all. You see the score of the 90s, right? 90 to like 80-something. But you got to understand there are so many little possessions, right, in today's NBAs. There's so many possessions now. So this kind of game would have actually been a low 100s game, right, in the 90s NBA, right? Today's standard, 94, 92, there's so many possessions. And here's why, right? A, 24-second shot clock. If you miss the shot and get it right back, it goes back to what? 14 seconds. Boom. In the old NBAs, it went back to 24 seconds. So that means you held on to the ball a lot longer. As far as the uh, no, the violation to go across half court, it was 10 seconds. Now it was 8 seconds. So you add that and combine, that's less possessions for the 90s guys. More possessions for today's NBA. That's why he scores so many points now. That's just a small thing. And of course, the fact that there's so much against the defense now that it makes these scores ridiculous. But now, playoff time, we need you guys to understand that playoffs, everyone is located on, everyone's like, they're focused on defense now. Everyone's so in tune to their defensive side. It makes you have these 94 to 92 games, right? I love it. This was a great week of basketball. Great week of sports, baseball, UFL, all that combined, man. You know, I want to thank everyone that was on this stream, on this channel, whether you were from YouTube, Twitter, X, Facebook. Thank you all for the love and support, man. All you guys, none of this is possible. Me and PJ both said the Thunder win this game, but boy, it was a heart attack for the Thunder fans. They barely got their wish come true. <laughs> So let's rock and roll, man. Thank you all once again for the love and the support. Without you guys, none of this is possible. Our final score, the Oklahoma City Thunder defeat the New Orleans Pelicans by a score of 94 to 92. What a game we had out of this. I'll see you guys tomorrow for Knicks versus Sixers game two of their series. I will be live, I believe, at 6.25 p.m. Central Time. I'm going to start knocking it down right now to at least get it out there for you guys. Much love. Thank you all, man. Have a blessed night. We are going to bed after I get done with all my uh, prep work, man. Maybe. Who knows? It's a long night. I'm a night person, so I'll be up all the time anyways. But uh, much love to all you guys. Thank y'all for the love and support, man. And uh, I will talk to y'all, uh, I guess, tomorrow, man. Well, I'll see you guys there. So have a great night. And uh, thank you all for showing love. All right, she says, salute, los, and peace. That's right. And he says, uh, Michael says, thanks for the stream. Carlos, PJ, and chat. See y'all tomorrow. That's right. See you guys tomorrow. Have a great night. Hit that like button on your way out. We're just one like away from 40. Smack that like button on your way out, you guys. And let's hit 40 before we get about of here. Much love to y'all. Peace. All sports fans, you guys know what time it is. Stay smart. Stay uneducated. Peace. Lay mama. You guys as well. Have a blessed night. Right here.